Hello, hello, hello everyone. This is Cynthia Toa, Miss Flippy, your Gypsy Metals Woman and your inspirational coach here to do a reading for Gemini. Gemini in the house for the month of February. Let's see what Gemini have. What's going on with the Gemini energy for the month of February? Yay, yay, yay. I have a, I'm a Gemini arising. That's what I am. Gemini arising. Let's see, let's see what the Gemini has to say for the month of February. Come on, cards. Be nicer than that. Mm -hmm. Be nice. Be nice, cards. <laughs> They're not being nice. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Let's see. This. <laughs> trust. Trust. Trust in the process. Trust that the universe knows what it's doing. Trust the universe has got your back. It really does. <laughs> even if we can't see it. Even if we don't know about it. Even if we think we've seen something differently than what the way that we think that we see it. That it's two different ways. I want you to trust. Trust in the process. Trust in the way you feel too. Don't allow uh, your vision to distort what it is that you're feeling on the inside. Making sure that you actually actually continue on sharing that love sharing your heart out there sharing that love that you got <laughs> from a loving being that's for the gemini in the house for the month of february this is for 2023 what do the cards have to say for the month of february for gemini gemini's in the house what do we got what do we got what do the cards got to say today for the gemini will you let us know we all let us know mm -hmm. win or lose yeah it is about sharing your heart no matter what it's because you know your heart always wins you know your, your heart is not going to let yourself falter mm -hmm win or lose. I want you to keep trusting in your instincts. Trusting in what it is that your instincts are telling you because your instincts are spot on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What else? What else do the cards have to say right now today? Mm -hmm. Let us know. Let us know. This is for the Gemini in the house. Mm -hmm. What the cards have to say? <laughs> They said, that's enough. <laughs> that was the background noise I heard. Wait, we want to know more, though. That's not enough. That's what we don't. Yeah, well, choose your battles then, you know. We have to choose our battles because this is this card of win or lose, you know. That's crystal clear. It doesn't matter. We need to make sure that we still are trusting in that person that we are. We're trusting in our instincts. We're trusting that we have, we have love to share with another individual out there. And we should actually share our love with many. But we have to choose the battles, not allowing any of the lower vibrational stories to come in to to um take away that trust from you i mean i've definitely been challenged this year so <laughs> and i'm a very trusting person but you know this year i i've definitely been challenged all right mm -hmm. what else what else is going on with the gemini's mm -hmm. Yeah, you know, we need to take any any area of our life that we're feeling sad, that we're feeling less and that we're not feeling complete. We need to come out of hiding and let ourselves come out and to shine. Let us come out above the ground and shine that beautiful shine that's within ourselves mm -hmm. for the Gemini. Yeah, to, to keep creating your love story, keep painting the picture, keep putting it out there in this awesome, amazing, beautiful way. Your efforts will be rewarded. Divine is not going to let you down. Divine is going to make sure you get that best love story yet, that best one ever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and because, because Divine has been listening to you, Divine has been hearing you, Divine has been feeling what it is that you've been trying to manage manifest into your life you've been trying to manifest this love that love that you want to share with another you've been doing it no matter what you haven't been letting anything get in the way of your love story mm -hmm. yep 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 you've been manifesting it into your life and divine is going to bring it your way mm -hmm. yep yeah we did have to we did have to deal with some of our inner child work we did have to do some of our inner child work we did have to go through some of the dark night of the souls to to making sure that we're you know telling the child within how much we truly really love ourselves we love the being that we are we're not gifting our love out there to someone else the love that we want from them without having that love with inside of ourselves so we've had to make sure that we've we've done the inner work mm -hmm. yeah what else what else With the gemini in the house 
because you definitely you definitely deserve you definitely be deserve to be up on top of the mountain and shining your best shine because you've done the work that's why that's why you deserve it is because you have done the work so when you're on top of the mountain you can take the lead because you did do the inner child work to allow you to step step forward that you're not working out of the darkness that you're working in the light this is the dark night of the soul that you went through to be able to step forward to start operating from your brighter self from your brightest story that you have so you can take that lead within your life to go in this this beautiful direction mm -hmm. Yeah, this awesome, amazing one. <laughs> yeah, what else, what else do the cards have to say? It's for the month of February. For those Geminis that are here watching the reading here today. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it is about a love story. This is about two people coming together and in love. They've, they've gone through a journey, but the journey is making sure that we did the self-love work first, that we fell deeply and completely in love with ourselves, not letting anybody or anything else distract us from that loving feeling. Mm -hmm. Yeah, what else, what else, what else is here for the collective? Oh, no, not for the collective. <laughs> well, the collective of Geminis. <laughs> How about that? <laughs> for the collective Geminis in the house here today. What else, what else is their energy for the month of February? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Opportunity buck and someone sees your worth, somebody sees your value, they're, 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 they're going to bring you an opportunity they see the light within and they're just um, um, trying to figure out how to bring that opportunity into your your being into your life mm -hmm. for you know to bring crystal clear answers to you so they can actually settle down your nerves about any beliefs that you've had in the past about this journey that you've been going on about your 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 opportunity the, where it is that you thought you were going that you haven't reached yet you're going to get clarity of belief of what that that the direction that you've been going, it's going to actually um, <clears throat> be showing up in the month of February. So you actually start making more momentum moving forward in this uh, direction because you did take time to rest and reconsider where your heart was going. You reconsidered it so much that your heart started pounding, your heart started flowing, it started uh, pumping again it started you know the light is within you're operating from your heart space mm -hmm. that's what when you took time out to rest you decided that you know you're going to continue on working from your heart space mm -hmm. yeah 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 <clears throat> That's what gives you the strength to take that forward movement and to take the lead. And that lead is operating from the brightest self with inside of you. So you're operating from, from strength, from courage, from laughter, from play, from love and above. <laughs> yeah, you're operating from a powerful self, you know. That's where you're, you're stable with inside of yourself. Yeah, and you go out there and you teach the world how to do the same, how it is that you are still able to no matter what, no matter what challenges came your way, no matter what kind of sadness or lower vibrational feeling came your way, that you still chose love and above and how you went about that. So you continue you to move forward in your life to be teaching others how to do the same. And you do it with a flow, just such a natural flow, by allowing this beautiful uh, self to come on out. Because you've learned how to release the light within this journey by detaching any lower vibrational story going on in the past by nurturing your soul. This is Cynthia Tullet, Man Flip It, your Gypsy Metals Woman and your inspirational coach. She does go live every Monday and Thursday nights at 9.30 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. Come on over and join on in. She does give free readings and paid readings. The difference is the paid readings get priority, <clears throat> meaning that they don't have to wait for their turn. Not unless I got several paid readings all at once, then it goes in the order that they came in. <clears throat> Until next time, have an awesome, amazing, beautiful day. Love you. Bye-bye, butterflies. Yeah.